Hello everyone, my name is Enzo Macarone and this is Pop Culture. It's been a very, very long time since I haven't listened to Metallica, so today I really want to listen to a new song from them because every time I listen to something new, they always do it great. I have liked all their songs so far, very varied rhythms, a lot of different combination between the instruments and the melodies so I'm really wondering what I'm going to encounter today for those who don't know me I am mostly a pop lover a pop head I usually listen to pop and um, very old music a lot of rhythms uh, rhythm and blues uh, hip hop rap trap but in the last year I decided that I wanted to discover more metal, more rock, hard rock, the best bands, the best songs. So this is my trip in order to know all these great bands that I have missed out because I usually listen to the same music and the same rhythms. I have read the lyrics, I have more or less an idea of what it is about, my interpretation. Then I'm going to ask you to write in the comment what is the real interpretation or what is what you have heard about the lyrics and what the meaning of the song is or what is your interpretation i am curious i want to know so without further to say let's jump right into the music and enjoy this powerful song is that arabic or Hindi is from India, that sound, that instrument. It has an aura of mystery. Oh yeah. So it started very Hinduish, uh, like a song from India, then it turned to electric guitar, but the same rhythm, and now it's beginning to get momentum. I love their long introductions. I was expecting the lyrics to go faster, but they are more like powerful, more paused. I don't know why I, I was thinking that he was going to talk fast, but no, it's slow. But also with all the song, it's like he's walking and saying, my home is everywhere.
it's like more menacing, like he's threatening you. Yeah. Oh. What the hell? Oh yeah. Incredible. Oh. I like how the drums take you to the guitar solo too. So catchy. It's very, very catchy. Yeah, I was missing the yeah, yeah. He has to say it in each song. Such a classic. Excellent. How? They are geniuses. How do they manage to do it? Such a complex but also catchy song. It's very catchy. You listen to it uh, for a few minutes and then you know the lyrics. They they sound so excellent, so tight. The the drums that take you to the guitar solo, the guitar solo that goes on forever, exploding everywhere and then you have the the voice, the voice from James very powerful as always menacing, threatening, uh, standing his ground because I think that the lyrics talk about being who you are, not thinking about the rest not thinking about what they are saying about you, just doing your stuff and maybe it's referring to the life as a band where you have to hit the road every single day, you travel a lot and you do gigs and concerts everywhere and so you make your home the road the road is your home because you don't have a, a house where you live all your life where, or go to work to uh, the same place during your whole uh, time here on earth you know a lot of places they have I think they have met uh, most of the most uh, important countries all around the world so you get to know the world you get to know a lot of people and you have to make your home the place where you are so I think the song is about that, about uh, living, in uh, traveling, living, doing concerts, doing uh, a lot of tours. Tell me what do you think about it. Uh, maybe it can have another interpretation as uh, anyone who, uh, who is not afraid of if, you, if things go wrong, if things go south, 
you are sure of yourself and you say if things are not working for me here in this place I can travel, I can go anywhere and I'm, I'm going to manage to keep moving forward. Maybe you can have another interpretation right there. But tell me what do you think about it, what is your interpretation or what you have heard. Maybe the band has said something because I'm not a, a great fan of, from Metallica. I just listen to some of their songs. I think they are great. But I'm not a metalhead. I'm usually a pop lover or pop head. So please tell me if you are more uh, informed. Uh, what is this song about? Is it about that? Tell me about it. And don't forget to leave me your suggestions for another band or another great songs. And leave a like because if you leave a like, I the YouTube algorithm is going to recommend me 10 times more. So thank you very much for the likes and the subscriptions. See you in the next video. Goodbye.